Movie sets must be the perfect workplaces for screw-ups and joking around. As gag reels have shown us, it doesn't matter what kind of movie the actors are working on. Whether it's a low-rent comedy or an Oscar-winning epic, sometimes the actors just can't keep a straight face when they're supposed to be taking things much more seriously. Chop Chop Liam Neeson definitely has a special set of skills, but in real life it's not being good at killing people, it's acting well. In films like Schindler's List and Rob Roy, Neeson showed that he's a serious actor who doesn't meet his roles halfway. Except on the set of The A-Team, where it's pretty clear that Neeson's special set of skills doesn't include being able to say the words, Attack Choppers. And his two attack chop chop. <laughs> Pike buys out every seat on the train, and his two attack choppers. <laughs> A Crowded Elevator Oscar winner Philip Seymour Hoffman, Oscar nominees Joaquin Phoenix and Amy Adams, and Emmy winner Rami Malek step into an elevator. It sounds like the setup to a joke, but it's just another day on the set of Paul Thomas Anderson's The Master, a serious movie about serious things. And then... <laughs> it's the one thing you're never supposed to do, especially around Oscar winners. But to everyone's credit, they found it pretty funny. Well, never one except Joaquin Phoenix. Joaquin Phoenix does not laugh if the script does not tell Joaquin Phoenix to laugh. Burning Sensation Harvard-educated Oscar-winning actress Natalie Portman took on a rare comedic role in the 2010 spoof Your Highness, a movie with some pretty ridiculous moments. I don't want to think about that. But just say that we were moments late and he was able to get her cookies. Shut up. Portman gave the film silly dialogue her all, but there's one line she had a really hard time getting through. I know the feeling well. It's been burning in my beaver since the... <laughs> it's been burning in my beaver. At least she tried. There will be bloopers. Daniel Day-Lewis has won three Oscars for Best Actor in a Leading Role, which is more than anyone else in history. He obviously puts a lot of work into his performances, to the point of staying in character even when the cameras aren't rolling. Day-Lewis doesn't even break character between takes, and yet here he is, during There Will Be Blood, cracking up with the actor who plays his son after a take. He's human after all. Pug Power Play 1997 sci-fi comedy Men in Black sees odd couple special agents played by Tommy Lee Jones and Will Smith take on a whole galaxy of alien oddities. One of their toughest foes comes in the form of a pug. To get information out of it, Jones' Agent K has to shake the crap out of it. The thing is, that was a real dog. So Tommy Lee Jones had to actually shake it and actually demand information from a little dog in his hands. Rosenberg said something about a galaxy on Orion's belt. What's he talking about, Frank? Beats me. Beats you. It must have been a ridiculous scene to film because even in the final cut, you can see Tommy Lee Jones starting to smile once before the camera cuts. Hand in Glove one of the funniest moments in Kubrick's 1964 Cold War satire, Dr. Strangelove, or How I Learned to Stop Worrying and Love the Bomb, finds the former Nazi scientist Dr. Strangelove, played by the incomparable Peter Sellers, struggling to control his own arm. Combined with a spirit of bold curiosity for the adventure ahead. <laughs> Although Sellers never breaks character, Peter Bull, standing to his left in the shot, can't quite keep it together during the off-the-wall performance. And really, can you blame him? Acting Suspect The infamous lineup sequence in The Usual Suspects was supposed to be a lot more serious. Unfortunately, the cast wouldn't play ball. According to Kevin Pollack, they just couldn't take the line seriously. And according to Gabriel Byrne, Benicio Del Toro would not stop farting. Eventually, director Brian Singer gave up, took a few different takes, and spliced them together. And a classic scene was born. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Click the looper icon to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Plus, check out all this cool stuff we know you'll love too.